Good evening. How are you? Good evening. I'm fine. Excellent. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Let's begin. Good evening. This is the English for Work program, beginner four. Welcome to your English class. Today is Wednesday, October the 4th, and this is class 13. Today we're going to be working on simple paths, yes, no questions. This is the general objective. This is the specific objective. This is the class objective. Participants will be able to make yes, no questions correctly using the simple paths. And this is the agenda. Tonight, we're going to be working on interrogation, situations, questions, practice, and conversation. Okay, before we begin, let's go to the attempt. Okay, uh, Adán Antonio Ramírez. Blanca del Carmen Santos. Carlos Amílcar Campos. Cecilia Maribel Alemán. Daniel Enrique Sifontes. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Edgar Edilson Reyes. Edwin Alexis Perez. Edwin Alfredo Alcón. Present teacher. Excellent, nice. Esmeralda del Rosario Porti. Gabriela Chamilez Ramirez. Gisela Guadalupe Martínez. Gladys Rubidia Nieto. Jonathan Stanles Perez. Good evening, Good teacher. teacher. Present. Good evening. Okay. Jose Daniel Cermeño. Jose Ernesto Alemán. Andy Natalia Sánchez. Mario Cristóbal Quintanilla. Mario Germán González. Presente. Excellent, nice. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Miguel Ángel Cortés. Noé, Noé Amilcar González. And Sergio Adolfo Hernández. Okay, welcome. Yes, board. Excellent, let's begin. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Let's begin. <clears throat> Today, we begin by asking questions. We're going to be asking questions. So when you say like interrogation, interrogation is mostly what the police officers do. They interrogate people. They ask questions about where they were, what, the, what they were doing. Over here, we're going to practice asking these questions. So the best would be questions questions. Did you study the lesson yesterday? Did you go to work yesterday? Did you play a game yesterday? Did you go shopping yesterday? Did you get up yesterday? Did you arrive to work yesterday? Did you spend time with your family yesterday? Did you listen to music yesterday? Did you watch TV yesterday? And did you read a book yesterday? And you say, ask different people, they will say, yes, I did, or no, I didn't, according to the reality. Good evening, Mario. Welcome on board. Okay, so, and then we're going to practice this conversation. First, the interrogation is not this part. The interrogation is in the conversation. Okay. 
So these are just questions. So we're going to go to the group. Let's go to the groups and uh, let's practice. Right now we're 13 people, so two groups will be okay. Okay, the groups are opening, please join. And let's practice asking and answering questions. Alguien? I'm not. I can. Okay. Es esta, verdad? Yes. Yes. Okay, who is that? Uh, ¿qué, ¿Qué es lo que íbamos a hacer? Disculpen. No alcancé a escuchar. What you have to do is practice. You're going to be asking and answering questions, right? You're going to be asking and answering questions in the groups. One okay. person asks, okay. one person asks, and the other answers. That's why you uh, have. Uh, did you study the lesson yesterday? Yes, I did. Or no, I didn't. Did you go to work yesterday? Yes, I did. Or no, I didn't. So, one. That's why you have A and B. One person says, "Did you study the lesson yesterday?" The other person says, "Yes, I did." Did you go to work yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you play a game yesterday? Yes, I did. Or no, I did. That's all. Uh, co uh, ¿Quién quiere participar? Okay, with me. Okay. Did you study the lesson? Did you study the lesson? Did you go jogging yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you get up early yesterday? Yes, get I up. did. Get up. Get up. Did you get, get up. up early yesterday? Mm -hmm. Yes, I did. Did you drive to work yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you spend time with your family yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you listen to music yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you watch TV yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you read a book yesterday? No, I didn't. Okay. Thank Someone you. Someone else? Thank you. Okay, okay. Hey, I'm ready. Ah, okay. I say the question and you the answer. Okay. Did you study the lesson yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you go to work yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you play a game yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you go shopping yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you go jogging yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you get up early yesterday? Get up. Yes. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up yesterday. 
early yesterday. Yes, I did. Did you drive to work yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you spend time with your family yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you listen to music yesterday? No, I did. Did you watch TV yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you read a book yesterday? Yes, I did. Okay, thank, thank you. you. Did you get get up early yesterday? Uh, no, I didn't. Did you drive to work yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you spend time with your family yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you listen to music yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you watch TV yesterday? No, I didn't. And did you read a book yesterday? No, I didn't. Okay, thank you. Okay. Someone else with me? Me, for me, or to kill. Okay. Yes. I start. Okay. I start. Okay. And did you study lesson yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you go? Did you go to work yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you play ga a game yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you go shopping yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you go jogging yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you did you get up early yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you drive to work yesterday? No, I didn't. Did you spend time with your family yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you listen to music yesterday? Yes, I did. Did you watch TV yesterday? No, I didn't. And did you read a book, a book yesterday? And no, I didn't. Okay, excellent. Okay, thank now let's go to the main session. Thank you very much. Okay. Ten people out. Okay. 11 people. All right. Everybody so Now let's begin. Practice this dialogue with a partner. Hi, Miriam. Can I ask you a question? Oh, hi, Marcos. Of course. What do you want to know? Did you close uh, the office door last night? Yes, I did. Did you knock it? Yes, I did. Are you sure? Yes, of course. What's the problem? Last night, someone broke into the office and stole your boss's laptop and some documents. 
Oh no, how did that happen? Apparently the door was unlocked and you were the last one to leave. What? Am I a suspect? Unfortunately, yes. At least until we discover what happened. I see. I have worked here for 12 years. We know. Okay, so this is the interrogation. Hi, Miriam. Can I ask you a question? Oh, hi, Marcos. Of course. What do you want to know? Did you close the office door last night? Yes, I did. Did you lock it? Yes, I did. Are you sure? Yes, of course. What's the problem? Last night, someone broke into the office and stole your boss's laptop and some documents. Oh no, how did that happen? Apparently the door was unlocked and you were the last one to leave. What? Am I a suspect? Unfortunately, yes. At least until we discover what happened. I see. I have worked here for 12 years. We know. Okay. Do you have any questions about the conversation? No questions. No question for me, teacher. No questions. Okay. Did you lock it? Is did you use the key to close it? Right? Did you close it with the key? Did you lock it? Uh huh. Unlocked means not secured. The door was only to pull it and it opened. It was not locked, so it was unlocked. Mm -hmm. Suspect. A person is uh, innocent until is well over here we say innocent, but in the states they say not guilty. The person is not guilty until proven otherwise. So unfortunately, unfortunately, at least, okay. Of course, what do you want to know? Did you close the office door last night? Yes, I did. Did you lock it? Yes, I did. Are you sure? Yes, of course. What's the problem? Last night, someone broke into the office and stole your boss's laptop and some documents. Oh no, how did that happen? Apparently, apparently, the door was unlocked and you were the last one to leave. And you were the last one to leave? What, am I a suspect? Unfortunately, yes. At least until we discover what happened. I see, I have worked here for 12 years. We know. Okay, let's go and practice the conversation, okay? The, the rooms are opening, please join. Yes, I did. Are you sure? 
<laughs> yes, of course. What's, what's the problem? Last night, someone broke into the office and stole your bus laptop and some documents. Oh, no. How did that happen? That what happened? Apparently, the door was unlocked and you were the last one to leave. What? I am a suspect. Unfortunately, yes. At least until we discover what happened. I see. I have worked to I have worked here for 10 no 12 12, 12, 12 I have years. Worked, worked here for 12 years. We we now change the roles. Change the role, Gabby. Okay. Hi, Edwin. Um, can I ask ask you a question? Oh, hi, Gabby. Of course. What do you want to know? Did you close the office door last night? Yes, I did. Did you look? Yes, I did. Are you sure? Yes, of course. What's the problem? Last night, someone broke into the office and I and, and stole your boss laptop and some documents. Oh, no. How did that happen? Apparently, the door was unlocked and you were the last one to leave. What? Am I a suspect? Unfortunately, yes. At, la at least until we discover what happened. What happened? I see. I have worked here for 12 years. We know. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Someone else can try with me? Uh, yes. Unfortunately. 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 Ah, okay. okay, thank you. Next. The change. Okay, Adam. Okay. Hi, Adam. Can I, can I ask you a question? Oh, hi, Marcos. Oh, of course. What do you want to know? Did you close the office door last night? Yes, I did. Did you lock, did, did you lock it? Did you lock it? Yes, I did. Are you sure? Yes, of course. What the problems? Last night, someone broke into the office and stole your boss laptop and some documents. Oh no, how did that happen? Apparently the door was unlocked and you were the last one to leave. Leave? What? I am a suspect. Unfortunately. Am I, am I a suspect? In Unfortunately, my... I left only we discovered what happened. I think I have worked here for 12 years. We know. Thank you, Adam.
Next. Next, me. ¿Alguien más? I am ready again. Okay, si quiere, empiece usted. Hi, Miriam. Can I ask you a question? Oh, hi, Marcos, of course. What do you want to know? Do you close the office? Hi Miriam, can I ask you a question? Oh, hi Michael, of course. What do you want to know? Did you close the office door last night? Yes, I did. Did you lock it? Yes, I did. Are you sure? Yes, of course. What's the problem? Last night, some, someone broke into the office and stole your boss laptop and some documents. Oh, no. How did that happen? Apparently, the door was unlocked and you were the last one to leave. What? Am uh, I a su suspect? Am I a suspect? Am I a suspect? Am I a suspect? Unfortunately, yes. Unfortunately. At least. At least you until we discover what's happening. I see. I have worked here for 12 years. We know. <laughs> okay, thanks. Okay, let's go to the main session. Mar Let's see, um, let's assess yesterday's situation. Maybe you remember that yesterday we worked on negative sentences. So we had like, so we had something like, let's, let me see, and disconnect the work on. Let me see. Something like this, we have like, I was tired yesterday. Negative. I wasn't sick. Were you upset? You say, yes, I was. Or, no, I wasn't. Okay, if to make the question with the verb to be, say, maybe you remember, you say, You were at school yesterday. To make the question, what we do is we move this part. This part, we move it to the beginning. And then we say, uh, 
were you at school yesterday? Were you at school yesterday? You say, uh, she was busy yesterday. Was she busy yesterday? So to make the question, you move the verb to be to the beginning. But things are different with the other form. You say, I liked the sandwich. I like the sandwich. Negative. I didn't like the lemonade. Did you like the cake? You say, yes, I did. Or, no, I didn't. Okay, so I like the sandwich. I didn't like the lemon. Did you like the sandwich? Yes, I did. Or, <clears throat> no, I did. Now you say like this. You watched the TV program. Now, to make this a question, what do you do? Like a normal question. You have this. You ask. If you watch. If you put do, there is a problem. Right? Uh huh. There is a problem because the verb is in the past. So what do we do? We transfer the ev that represents the past tense to the auxiliary. And the auxiliary is irregular. So what's the past tense of do? Did. Did. Then we say, did you watch without the ed? Because the past tense was removed, was moved to the auxiliary. Now the auxiliary is in the past tense. The verb is in the present. Did you watch the TV program? And the answer is with the same auxiliary, did. Yes, I did. No, I didn't. Did you? Yes, I did. No, I didn't. Okay, another example. Now this with an irregular verb. You say, you left home early. You left home early. Okay. Okay. You remember the question, right? To make the question, we always write do, the auxiliary, the question mark. But then we have the verb in the past, the auxiliary in the present. And that is wrong, right? So what do we do? Transfer the tense of the verb to the auxiliary. So then the, the auxiliary is in the past, did. The verb is not in the past anymore. So you say, did you leave? Did you leave home early? Okay, so we have two things. The form 
but also the intonation. Did you leave home early? Yes, I did. Did you leave home early? Did you leave home early? Okay. So the last part goes up. Okay. Did you watch TV? Did you watch the TV program? Did you leave home early? The sentence is not like that. The sentence is, you left home early. You watched the TV program. Okay, but the question is, did you watch the TV program? Did you leave home early? So it goes up. Okay, so this is for the past tense. Okay, now this is what we're going to be checking here. Here we have some examples. I received my salary yesterday. I didn't receive my salary yesterday. Did you receive your salary yesterday? Yes, I did. Okay, short form, complete form. Yes, I did. I received my salary yesterday. Yes, I received my salary yesterday. No, I didn't. No, I didn't. I, I received my salary last week. No, I didn't. I didn't receive my salary yesterday. So for the negative forms. Okay. Continue with the past tense, with the forms. You say, I liked tennis, but I didn't like football. I didn't live in London. I didn't live in London for a long time. I was 19 years old at the time. I was. I was 19 years old at that time. I was student when I met her. I was student when I met her. He lived in London during the war. What war? The World War II. I didn't play. I didn't play the piano, but I played the, the guitar. They didn't work last week. John didn't live in Manchester for a long time. Angela didn't drive to work. She went by bus. I played soccer every weekend when I was at the university. I, I played soccer every weekend when I was at the university. Okay. So we have like this, I liked, I didn't like, I didn't live, I was, I was met. Lived, didn't play, played, didn't work, didn't live, didn't drive. Okay, so when it's in affirmative, well, let's say like this, only in affirmative do we use the verb in the, in the past. We use... Uh, the, the name, I mean, let's say the auxiliary in the past and the verb in the present in negatives and in questions. Negatives and questions. Go, didn't go. Study, didn't study. Question, did you study? Did you go? Did you play? So the auxiliary is in the past, but the verb is in the present. Verbs in the present. Okay. Let's see, we're going to read two situations with two different companies. I'm going to read it first and I'll have volunteers read them later. First we have with Mrs. Mendoza. I have a problem with uh... Railroad system, mm -hmm. but a destination came to help. Help me with it. With, with it. With it. 
He broke. He broke. He gave me copy of the report. The report? But I didn't the report. But I didn't understand. Understand it? Understand it. Mm -hmm. Besides all that? All that. I forgot to mention that he came very late. Very late. Uh -huh. Excellent. Thank you very much. Who would like to read Mr. Torres? Me, teacher. Thank you. Uh, I had a problem with the car's engine, so I called for assistance. The mechanic... Assistance? assistance, assistance. Mm -hmm. For assistance. The mechanic was really kind. He got there very soon, and he was quick to fix my car's problem, too. He gave me details about the incident and he gave me a report of it. Then I started the engine and everything was perfect. Excellent. Thank you very much. Now again, Mr. Torres, Mario Gonzalez. Okay. Please go. Mr. Ahead. Torres. Yes. Uh, se escucha bien. Uh... Sure. Go ahead. Okay. I had a problem with the cars engine, so I called for assistance. Engine? Me mechanic. Engine. Uh -huh, mechanic. So I called for... For assistance. Ah, the mechanic... Uh, perdón, perdón, me, mm -hmm. me perdí. So I called for assistance. Uh, ah. I called for assistance. The mechanic was really kind. He got there very soon and he was quick to fix my car's problem. Two, he gave me details about the incident and he gave me a report of- Report? It. A report? Uh, a report of it. A report of it. Mm -hmm. Then I started the engine and everything engine? was perfect. engine. Ah, uh, engine. Okay. I started the engine and everything was perfect. Mm -hmm. You say, teacher, engine. Yes, like engine now. <laughs> uh -huh. Engine now. Okay, so engine. Okay, engine. Engine. Okay. Aníbal wants to read Mrs. Mendoza. Okay, go ahead, please. Thanks. Okay. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, my friend. I had a problem with the viral, viral system, but a technician came to help, to help me with, with that. Okay. Mm -hmm. it, he solved it, uh, but they didn't say anything. anything. He even shared more for a piece he worked. He gave me a copy of the report, but I didn't understand understand it. Mm -hmm. Besides all, all that, I forgot to mention that he came very late. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Yes. Who else wants to read Mrs. Mendoza? Me, teacher. Yes, please, Blanquita, go ahead. I had a problem with the payroll system, but a technics technician can to help uh -huh. with me. To with, help me? Help, help me, me with it. Yeah. He solved it, but Sol solved, it. It. Sol solved it. Solved it. Solved it. Solved it. But he didn't say anything. He even charged even me. Even even charge, charge me for charge me for a, a, a piece a piece a piece he broke it. he gave me a copy gave me, of gave me gave me a copy of the report 
report. Bed report. But I didn't understand it. By sight. Besides all that. Besides all that, I forgot to mention that he can very late. Okay, thank you very so, much. So, teacher. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't worry, Blanquita, it's okay. Remember, little by little, little by little, so the word, okay? Now let's go over the questions. Did Mrs. Mendoza have a problem with a method of payment? Did Mrs. Mendoza have a problem with the with a method of payment? Teacher, I don't understand method of payment. Method of, aha, method of, yes. Method of payment is a, you pay by credit card, you pay cash, you pay by check, you pay, well, that's a method of payment. You pay by debit card, by credit card, by, I mean, cash, check, right? So that would be the method of payment. But no, like um, Aníbal was saying, didn't have, she didn't have a problem with the pay, I mean, with the method of payment. She had problems with what, Aníbal? Would you please repeat? The payroll system. The payroll system, teacher. I don't understand the payroll system. <laughs> Okay, the payroll system is a type of program. Okay, payroll is the list. Okay, some people call it the roster of workers, the list of workers uh, and the money that they have to pay them, right? The mother system, teacher. Yeah, there is a system that calculates the deductions, I mean, taxes, uh, well, the revenue that you pay, the revenue, etc., income tax and everything. And then they give you how much you have to pay. So, Mrs. Mendoza had a problem with the payroll, right? Uh, and who solved it? Who solved the problem? Uh -huh, my dear Angelitos, who solved the problem? The technician. The technician, right? The technician. Uh -huh. um, but not everything was a bed of roses. Not everything was nice. What was the problem? That the technician broke a piece, right? The technician broke a piece. And uh, who paid for the piece? Who paid for the piece? Do you remember? Who paid for the piece? Mrs. Mendoza, right? Because she says he even charged me for it. He even charged me for a piece he broke, right? Okay. And um, that is a problem, okay? And the other problem was Mrs. Mendoza's personal problem. She didn't understand the report. <laughs> okay. Yeah, when something is too specialized, Sometimes we don't understand it. We see the, re the report. This was the problem. Uh, and we don't understand it. So, well, whatever, right? But she mentioned another problem with the technician. What was that? The technician was late. Okay, the technician was late. Why did Mrs. Mendoza mention that the technician was late? <laughs> because she was angry that she had to pay for the broken piece. She was happy 
that the technician solved the problem. But she wasn't happy that she had to pay for the broken piece. So she said, ah, and you know what? He came late too. Okay, so she wasn't happy. All right. So that is something that we say. He, he probably didn't come late. Probably he didn't come late, but she had to pay for the piece, so she was probably angry. Okay. Let's see, what about the other one? Uh, over here, what was the problem? Mr. Torres had a problem with what? The car's engine. The car's engine. Mm -hmm. Normally we say the engine of the car because car is not animated. So we don't use possessive for car, the engine of the car. So she had, or simply we use a compound noun, car engine, no cars engine. Okay, so he had a problem with the car engine. Uh-huh. And uh, what he what did he do about what did he do about the problem? What did he do about the problem with the car engine? He called. Call. I call I called for assistance. He called for assistance. And uh, did he have a good experience or a bad experience? Good experience. A good experience, right? Good experience. Because what, what are the positive things? Number one, the mechanic. He got very, very soon. Was really kind. The mechanic was really kind. He got there very soon. Number three? He was quick to fix my car. Problem. He was quick to fix my car problem. Two. Uh -huh. And uh, number four? What's he number four? Me, he, gave, he, gave, he gave me details about He gave me the details of the incident. Uh -huh. Okay. And uh, number five? He gave, he gave me a report. report. He gave me a report of it. Mm -hmm. Okay. So the best, the best of everything, I started the engine and everything was perfect. Perfect. I started the engine and everything was perfect. Okay. perfect. So that would be the situation. Mm -hmm. All right. Excellent. So here in number one. Did Mrs. Mendoza have a problem with the method of payment? No, she didn't. She had a problem with the payroll system. Did Mr. Torres call his best friend for help? No. Who did he call? Ghostbusters. No, the Ghostbusters, no. Who did he call? He called a mechanic. He called the mechanic. So, but it's a yes, no question. So bef before we say this, we have to say no. No, he didn't. No, he didn't. He called the mechanic. And over here we say, no, she didn't. No, she didn't. No, she didn't. She had a problem. With the payroll system. She had a problem with the payroll system. Okay. Excellent. Let's move on. Questions. These are some examples that we have. Did you call a mechanic to check your car? Yes, I did. No, I didn't. 
Did she pay extra money? Yes, she did. No, she didn't. Did we receive a report? Yes, we did. No, we didn't. Did they sign the letter? Yes, they did. No, they didn't. Okay, so did you call? Did you call a mechanic to check your car? Yes, I did. No, I didn't. Did she pay extra money? Yes, she did. No, she didn't. Did we receive a did we receive a report? Yes, we did. No, we didn't. Did they sign the letter? Yes, they did. No, they did. Okay. Examples. We have what I want you to pay attention in the examples is the auxiliary in the past. See? All of them. Auxiliary in the past. Did. And in the present, the verb. All of the verbs are in the present. Did you want? Did you call? Did you bring? Did you make? No, did it make? Did we watch? Did the children participate? Did you eat? Did it rain? Did you go? Did they attend? Did the store give? So the auxiliaries in the past, the verb in the present. Auxiliary in the past, verb in the present. Did you want something to eat? Did she call you back? Did you, did your friends bring something? Did it make any weird noises? Did we watch that movie before? Did the children participate in the game? Did you eat breakfast this morning? Did it rain last night? Did you go on a trip last weekend? Did they attend university together? Did the store give you a discount? And then the answers, yes, I did, no, I didn't, etc. Okay, so this is important. Auxiliary in the past, verb in the present. Capital letter at the beginning of the question and question mark at the end, question mark. The short answers, capital letter, comma, I did, he did, she did, etc. Period. Right? So that is something that we need to pay attention. Punctuation is also important. Okay. Were you happy last night? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Were you at home last week? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Did you have breakfast this morning? Yes, I did. I had fried ground beans and scrambled eggs. You say, no, I didn't. I didn't eat anything all morning. Were you at a concert yesterday? Yes, I was. I was at a concert yesterday. It was very good. No, I wasn't. I wasn't at a concert. I was at home. Did you go to the concert yesterday? Yes, I did. I went to the concert yesterday. It was great. No, I didn't. I didn't go to the concert. I was very busy. So these are the examples of the questions and the answers. Okay, here we have more examples of the questions before we practice, okay? Did you play baseball? Yes, I did. I played baseball all afternoon. Did you play baseball? No, I didn't. I didn't play baseball at all. Did you meet Jane in middle school? Yes, I did. I met her there. Did you meet Jane in middle school? No, I didn't. I didn't meet her there. Were you home yesterday? Yes, I was. I was there all day. No, I wasn't. I wasn't there at all. So we have questions and answers. All right. 
Before we get to the first thing that we're going to do, we're going to have these questions and we're going to be practicing with your partners. Where you Mm -hmm. The answer is going to be yes, I was, or no, I was. Hey, tired, bad. Angry, busy, nervous, worry, surprise. Anxious, hot, cold. Sad. Now, sad, we already have happy, busy. Now, we have busy already. Tired, sad, angry, busy, nervous, upset, worried, surprised, anxious, hot, cold, uh, happy. Okay, what else? Sleepy. Asleep. Bored. Mm -hmm. so confused. Relaxed. Repeat it for me. Tired. Tired. Sad. Angry. Angry. Busy. Busy. Nervous. Nervous. Upset. Upset. Worried. Worried. Surprised. Surprised. Anxious, anxious, hot, hot, cold, cold, happy, happy, sleepy, sleepy, asleep, asleep, bored, bored, confused, confused, relaxed, relaxed. Let's see, we're going to practice in the groups, but I'm going to send this to the WhatsApp and to the other, to the other, uh, I'm going to send it to both. The WhatsApp. And I'm going to send it to the groups. So let's go to the groups and let's practice asking and answering this question. One person asks, were you tired last night? Yes, I was. Were you sad last night? Yes, I was. Were you angry last night? No, I wasn't. Were you busy last night? Yes, I was. Excellent. Okay, the groups are opening. Please join.
Okay. Let's practice. The lady feels. I start. Ladies first. Okay. Were you tired uh, last night? No. Yes, I was. <laughs> Were you sad last night? Yes, I was. Were you angry last night? No, I wasn't. Were you busy last night? Busy. Busy. Yes, I was. Busy last night. Mm -hmm. Were you ner nervous? 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 Uh -huh. Nervous? No, I wasn't. Were you upset last night? No, I wasn't. Were you worried last night? Yes, I was. Were you surprised last night? No, I was. Were you anxious last night? Yes, I was. Were you hot last night? No, I wasn't. Were you cold last night? No, I wasn't. Were you happy last night? Yes, I was. Were you sleepy last night? No, I wasn't. Were you confused last night? Yes, I was. Were you relaxed last night? Yes, I was. Okay. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Well. Blanca. Veamos quién más. With me. Okay, Mario. I am the okay. answer. Were you tired last night? No, I wasn't. Were you sad last night? No, I wasn't. Were you angry last night? Yes, I was. Were you sad, mostly, roughly? Busy. Busy last night? Yes, I was. Were you nervous? Nervous. 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 Last nervous. Night. Nervous, last nervous, night. nervous last night. Nervous last night. No, I wasn't. Were you upset last night? What What is the meaning of upset? Yes. Um, no. Mm -hmm. finish. finish right okay. okay okay now let's go to the main session okay okay teacher okay. nice very good We are nine people out, 10.
11 people out, 12. Excellent. Everybody's out. Now let's see. Uh, what's question number one? He says, yes, I did. I sent the email. What's the question? You send the email. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Did you send the email? Did you send the email? Yes, I did. Send the email. Okay, hello. Uh, this is only for the exercise. In real life, people don't speak like that, okay? Don't you think that in real life, people say like, hey, did you go to the movies yesterday? Yes, I did. I went to the movies yesterday. Did you park the car? Oh, yes, I did. I parked the car. Did you study the lesson? Oh, yes, I did. I studied the lesson. Not right. No, no, no. People say, yes, I did. And that's it. Hey, did you park the car? Yeah. Near Fulanito's house. Ah, okay. Is it, is it safe there? Yeah, I guess so. You don't say, -da 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 completely. But this is for the exercise. Okay, for the exercise. In real life, no. If you speak like that, <laughs> okay, it's a comedy for the Americans. Okay, if they ask you, "Did you finish your work?" You say, "Yes, I did. I finished my work." They <laughs> they they laugh, right? Uh, Arturito. Okay. Let's see. Arturito. 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 Uh -huh. <laughs> So they say, no, they didn't. They didn't check the package. What's the question? Did they, did they did check they, the package? Did they check, check the package? The package. Did they say check the package? Teacher, it's an A. Package. <laughs> yes. Okay. Excellent. Ah, but it's a question, man. Question mark, question mark. So teacher, but the question mark at the end. Yes, but I prefer to put them near the question. So did they check the package? No, they didn't. They didn't check the package. Number three, what's the question for three? Did the car? Uh, so. <laughs> Did the car start again? Start again. Okay. Did the car okay? Did the car start again? Sometimes when the car stalls, okay, you're driving and suddenly <sighs> and then did we never receive a copy of the receipt? Uh -huh. Exactly. Did, uh, did you ever did you ever receive <laughs> a copy? Copy receipt of the receipt. Did you ever? receive a copy of the receipt you say no we didn't we never received a copy of the receipt okay number five yes he did he bought a new tire <laughs> okay did he buy exactly. a new tire did he buy, a new tire? Did he buy mm -hmm. did he a new buy tire. A new tire. Teacher, but tire this tire, right? Concept. Yes, but this tire is how many tires does a car have? Four. Four. No. Five. 
Normally, is did she understand what I said? Did she understand what I said? What did I she... said, what I said is lo que dije. Enten... Entendió ella lo que yo dije? Did she understand yes. what I said? And you say, no, she didn't. She didn't understand that word you said. Okay. Or you say, no, she didn't understand a word. Okay. She didn't understand. No, she didn't. She didn't understand a word you said. So, has to be here, you said. Did she understand what you said? No, she didn't. She didn't understand the word I said. Ni una palabra de lo que dije. Right? She didn't understand uh, a word I said. She didn't understand the word I said. Mm -hmm. Did she understand what I said? What I said is lo que dije, right? What I said. Did she understand what I said? No, she didn't understand, right? No, she didn't. She didn't understand a word I said. Nada de lo que dije. Okay, so. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Okay, let's now let's go to task. practice. First, put in order. Put in order. So we're going to put in order. Then we're going to complete. Please remember. I'm going to put it here. Past. Present. Present. Please remember. Past, present, past, present, past, present. So the example would be? What's the example? Did, in... Mer did, did Mary, did, did did Jack, Mary watch did her Mary favorite watch, program? Mary, watch. Did Mary watch her favorite program? <laughs> did Mary watch her favorite program? Mm -hmm. Exactly. Very good. So you're going to put this in order, and you're going to complete this with your part. Okay? Two. So let's go. Let's go there. The groups are opening. Please join. Oops. 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 Okay, group one, group two. Okay, the first is the Mary watch. The ones in order first, the one before? Yes, uh, the second, did Jack go? Mm -hmm. The first exercise, you need to put the sentences in order. You finish that part? Okay. Uh, right. One before, Sergio. 
La Dis anterior. Sister to the hunger. Sirs. Did Mary. Did Mary help you? Help you. Dinner yesterday. Yesterday. Okay. Dinner yesterday. With dinner yesterday. But did you like food? Did you like the food? The food? Did, did, did you like, like the food? The food. Did you? Okay. Did she win the game? Yes. Did she win the game? Okay. Did you get um, did, did, did you get up? Did you get, get, up, get up yesterday? Get up yesterday. Get up yesterday. Get up yesterday. Mm -hmm. Did you go, go to, to work, work yesterday? yesterday? Did you go to work yesterday? Did you Did you know the truth? The truth. Did you know the truth? Okay. Did you go to bed early? Yes, did you go? Did you to bed go early. to bed early? Bed okay. early. <laughs> <laughs> did you find the keys in the office? The key, you, the key in the did office. Did you find the keys in the office? In the office, okay. Siguiente. Ok. Sí, va. Ok. Ok. Complete the okay. question, my name. Bueno, primero ya la habíamos hecho. Did Mary watch her favorite program? Yes. Did Jack go? Did Jack go, go go to church yesterday? Okay. Did Susie watch Susie? Ryan report last Friday. Did Becky Did... find the case and the drawer? Find the keys in the drawer. The keys in the drawer. In the drawer. In the drawer. In the drawer. Find the, uh -huh. the keys in the drawer. Drawer. And the keys and the drawer. In the drawer. Thank Did Mar wear a suit to the party? Did Tony use a pen to sign the document? Sign. 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 Pen to sign, sign the, the document. document. Sign the document. 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 Does Sylvia think about the problem? Did Janet ride her bicycle to a school? Did Jack, Did Jack to, to drive, drive, drive to, the drive to work yesterday? Did Bessie drink soda mm -hmm. at the party yesterday? Did Bess see her friends after work? Did Kimberly come home early last night? Did Joe wait for you in the car? Did Peter meet your parents last weekend? Finish. Mm -hmm.
Did you go to bed early? Early. 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 Oh, early. Did you find did you find the, the keys in the office? In the office. Okay. Y number two también. Sí, la, la siguiente también. The keys in the drawer. The smart square. No more. Where? 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 No, te dijo que terminaras mañana en la mañana. Anda, acostate ya. Sí. 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 Excellent. Let's go to the main. Session. The general right. Ah, oh, you haven't finished that one. Yes. Yes, you did. Okay. Let's go on. The general right. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, there are eight people. Okay, 14 people out. What's number one? Did you understand my question? Did you understand my question? Yeah. Number two. Did your sister do the homework? Did your sister do your homework? Excellent. What about number three? He married, did Mary help with the dinner yesterday. did mary help you help with, you help uh -huh. you with dinner yesterday yes did mary Sorry, help teacher, you with dinner I, yesterday? i know glasses and um tengo <laughs> dificultad para leer. don't worry it's okay let's see the next one four did you, did you like the food did you like the food five Did she win the game? Did she game. win the game? Did she win the game? <clears throat> Six. Did you get up early yesterday? Did you get up early yesterday? Did you get up early yesterday? Seven. Did you go to work yesterday? Did you go to work yesterday? Eight. Did, Did you, you know, know the, the truth? truth? Did you know the truth? Did you know the truth? Nine. Did you go to bed early? Did you go to bed early? Ten. Did you? Did you, Did you find, find the keys in the 
office? Did you find office. the keys in the office? Mm -hmm. Did you find the keys in the office? Excellent. Now, let's complete this one. What about number one? Did Mari. Did Mary watch? Did Mary? Did Mary watch uh, her favorite her favorite program. program? Number two. Did Jack go? Did Jack go to church yesterday? Three. Did you see <clears throat> her first last? Friday. Did Susie write a report last Friday? Four. Four. Did Becky did Becky find keys in the car? Did Mark Mark where 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 did Mark wear a suit to the party? Did Six. Tony? Did Tony, did Tony use, 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 a, a, use pen. a pen to sign the document? Did Sylvia? Did Sylvia think about think, the problem? Think, did Sylvia think about the problem? Eight. Did Janet ride her bicycle to school? Ride her bicycle to school. Did Jack, Did Jack drive, 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 drive to work yesterday? Then drive. did Bessie drink. drink soda at the party yesterday? <laughs> Eleven. Did Beth see her friends after work? Twelve. <laughs> Did Kimberly come? Did Kimberly come? Did Kimberly come home near? I mean, early last night. Did Joe, did Joe wait for you in the car? Did Joe wait for you, wait in, the car? For you in the car? Mm -hmm. did, did, did Peter meet your parents last weekend? Did, did Peter meet your parents last weekend? Yeah. Excellent. Very good. <clears throat> okay. Now... What you're going to do is you're going to match this, the questions and the answers. It says sentence has, but it's question and answer, question and answer. What's the, the, the answer corresponding to the question? Example, what did you do yesterday? Okay. I had to work yesterday. I had to work yesterday. I went to shopping. Where did you go last night? Where did you go last night? I went to the shopping mall last night. Okay. So this is one. The other one. Transform into questions. Transform into questions. Example, Mary did a good job. Did Mary do? Did Mary do a good job? Did Mary do a good job? Did is the auxiliary, do is the verb. Did Mary do a good job? Two, did Jack finish the project? Do is the auxiliary, I mean, did is the auxiliary, finish is the verb, okay? So let's do this too. <clears throat> let's go to the groups and let's do that. The groups are opening. Please join.
that. Okay, number one. What did you do yesterday? Letter B, I had to work yesterday. Number two. Where did you go last night? I went to buy medicine. Letter A. A. No, a D. There are D. Okay. Ah, okay. Last night. Number three. Yes. What did you go to the store? Number three, letter A. Letter A. Why did you go to the store? I went to buy to buy medicine. When did you finish reading book? Letter G, I finished. Anna. No, no, no. Letter E. Letter e. I finished it, it last Friday. In last Friday, yes. Very soon. In last when Friday. did you learn that? I learned that it in the string. Letter C. Meet. I meet. George, George and, and Betsy. Betsy. Okay. What time did you get up today? I got out of at five a.m. Who helped you with you homework? With homework. Mm, my mom helped me. Help. Pudiera hacer. Mm -hmm. What time did you finish work? I finished work at 6 p.m. 6 p.m. Okay. When did you come back? I come back last Monday. I come back last Monday. What, what did, did you, you have, have for breakfast? What did you have to breakfast? I had eggs and bacon for breakfast. Okay. Los huevitos. Okay. How did you do that? How did you do that? Mm. How did you do that? It very good job. A good job. Okay, number two. Did you finish the project? Finish it. Finish the project. Okay, number three. This don't send. 
packages to warehouse. To warehouse number four. Did Betty find money in the street? Find. Find money. My phone in the street. Okay, number five. Did Mar feel? Feel. Feel. Feel sad. That last night. Last night. Mm. Uh, me or now? Did me or now? Did me or now like the new restaurant? Did Bessie buy buy a new car? New car. Okay. Did Sony come to work late? To work late. Did Craig need, need some new work? Need some new worker. New workers. Number ten. The ten lose. His wallet today. His wallet today. Today. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, did Joe is this sleep? Live, live. Did home early today. Home early. Today, number twelve, did Jim Jean. fail the exam? The exam yesterday. Okay, number thirteen, did George eat tacos last night? The George is the last night. And did Fred listen to music all day? Did Fred listen to music all day? All day. Finish. Finish. Good job. Finish the two. Okay. Let me check the other group. Okay. Did. 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 Cry. Did. Cry. Did. Cry. Need. Did. Some new. Some worker. Worker. Did. Did. Thing. Los. His wallet today. Today. Did John Alex Alex 
I don't know. Live. 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 Ah, live. 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 Ah, live. 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 Yesterday. Yesterday. Did George eat tacos last night? Did George eat tacos last night? Mm. Did Fred listen to music? Oh. Listen, listen, Eva. Or no, solo listen. No, listen. So only listen because you use the did. To music all day. Rap music. El número 10 no es los. El de. Number 10. 10. Yes. Los. 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 Uh -huh. Pero es los. No. Los. No. No, es que es el los luz. Quiero ver. Mm -mm. Let's go to the main session. Okay. okay. Excellent. Okay. Seventeen. Now let's let's see. What did you do yesterday? What did you do yesterday? I had to I had work. Had to work yesterday. Had to I work had to work yesterday. Um, mm, I like this one. I like more like here. Uh -huh. Maybe like that. Okay. 
Where did you go last night? I got up. I went to the shopping the mall. Shopping. I went to the shopping mall last night. Why did you go to the store? I went to buy a medicine. I went Medi to buy medicine. I went to buy medicine. When did you finish reading the book? I finished. I finished it last Friday. Last Friday. Where did you learn that? I learned in the I street. Learned in the I street. learned it in the street. Who did you meet? I meet meet George, George and Ben. And I met. I met. I met. George, George and, Betsy. and Betsy. I met George and I Betsy. Met, what I time met. did you get up today? I got up at five. I got, I, I got no, up. I got up at five a.m. I get up at five a.m. I got up. I got up at five a.m. I got up at five a.m. Who helped you with the homework? My, my mom, mom helped, helped me. me. My mom helped me. Helped me. My mom helped me. What time did you finish work? I, I finished, finished work at Friday. Six, six, finished six, work yeah. at 6 p.m. I finished work at 6 p.m. Ah, yes. When did you come back? I come back last night. I come oh. back. I come back last Monday. I came back. I came back. I came, I came, back. came back last Monday. <clears throat> what did you have for breakfast? I had eggs, eggs and, bacon and bacon for, for breakfast. breakfast. I had eggs and bacon for breakfast. How did you do that? I trained it I, very hard. I trained very hard. Mm -hmm. I tried it very hard. Where did you study English? I, I studied English, English at the university. At the university. English at the university. When did she start the project? She started the project last the week. Project, she started mm -hmm. the project last week. She started the project last week. She started the project last week. Okay. Transform into questions. <clears throat> okay, let's see if we can do. Uh, only yes? a little bit in another picture. I uh -huh. agree. Ah, I will uh -huh. send you. I will send you this after class. Yes. I, after I class, I. Uh huh. Ready. All right. Excellent. <laughs> I send you this after class. You. That is the answer. <clears throat> okay, maybe you have seen after class, I send you this and I put answers. Okay, did you, Mary did a good job, question? Did Mary do did a good Mary job? Mary do oh, a good job. good job. Did Mary do, do a good, a good job? job. Did Mary do a good job? Jack finished the project. Did Jack finish Did Jack. the project? Did Jack finish the project? Tom sent the packages to the warehouse. Did Tom send the package to where? Tom sent the package, the packages to the warehouse. Betty found money in the street. Did Betty find 
money in the street. To be the dirty fine money in the street. Mark felt sad last night. Did Mark feel sad last night? Mirna, sorry, this is past tense. Mirna liked the new restaurant. Did Mirna like the new restaurant? Did Mirna like the new restaurant? Bessie bought a, a new car. We say, did Bessie? <clears throat> buy a new car. Number eight. The sunny. Come. The sunny come to work late. The great. Did Craig knew? Did Craig knew the some new workers? Okay, some new workers. Tom lost his wallet today. Did Tom lose? His wallet today. Joe. Joe. Did Joe leave? Leave home early today. Leave today. Leave home early. early. Early today. Yeah. Did Jim failed the exam yesterday. Did did Jim fail fail the exam yesterday? Yesterday. So did Jim fail the exam yesterday? Did George, did did George. George eat tacos? Eat last did George eat tacos, eat tacos last, last night. night? Excellent. Did Fred, did Fred listen to music? To music all day. All day. All day. Did Fred listen to music all day? All right. This would be the, you say the other one. I'm going to send you the answers. Don't worry. Only these ones because we didn't leave a place to write them. But then the others. Only listen to the conversation. Look at this beautiful place. Would you like to live here? Yeah. Definitely, right? I would like to live yeah. here. Yeah. Yes, I would like, like, like this. I would like to live here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Practice this dialogue with a partner. We're going to only listen to it. Okay, so. Okay. This is between a recruiter and uh, Ronnie. Good morning. Good morning. What's your name? <clears throat> My name is Ronnie Ryan. Why do you want to work with us? Because you are the best company in town. Did you used to work for the competition? Yes, I did. Only that you have no competition. Why do you say that? Your techniques are unique. Maybe, but now you're going to learn them. 
I will put them to good use. We will make you the best salesman. Okay, thanks. So this is the conversation. <clears throat> now let's go to attendance. Let's go to attendance. Alan Antonio Ramirez. Present teacher. Excellent. Blanca del Carmen Santos. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Carlos Amilcar Campos. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Cecilia Maribel Alemán. Daniel Enrique Sifontes. Present teacher. Excellent, very good. Edgar Edilson Reyes. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Edwin Alexis Perez. Present teacher. Good, nice, very good. Edwin Alfredo Alcón. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Esmeralda del Rosario Portillo. Present teacher. Excellent. Let's see. Gabriela Yamilez Ramirez. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Gisela Guadalupe Martinez. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Gladys, Gladys Rubiria Nieto. Jonathan Stanley Perez. Okay, excellent. Jonathan Stanley Perez. Nice, very Present good. Present teacher. Very good, nice. Jose Daniel Cermeño. Okay. Jose Ernesto Alemán. Andy Natalia Sánchez. Mario Cristóbal Quintanilla. Present teacher. Excellent, very good. Mario Germán González. Good night, teacher. Hey, good evening, my friend. Good night. Yeah, good night. Take care. Mauricio Antonio Rivera. Mauricio Antonio Present. Rivera. Miguel Ángel. Present. Excellent. Miguel Ángel Cortés. Present. Very good. Noé Aníbal González. Present teacher. Nice, very good. Sergio Adolfo Hernández. Present teacher. Excellent, very good. Thank you very much for attending tonight. Tonight, Jonathan Stanley Perez stays, the other people. Thank you very much for attending. I will see you tomorrow. Good night, my friend. Thank you, Thank you teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Take care. You too. Take care. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Good night. Hey. Hello, Jonathan. Hello, teacher. What can I do for you, my friend? What questions do you have? Um, I don't have a question because the topic is no more difficult, teacher. Not too difficult, right? Okay. More yeah. practice because the I don't have um, um, more ideas. Mm -hmm. Forma de preguntar cosas, yes. quizás. Uh -huh. But it's okay. no difficult. Not difficult. Well, little by little, my friend, little by little. Yeah. Then if if um, you don't have any more questions, I let you go so that you may do your homework. And uh, when you finish, you may go to bed early. And tomorrow we continue. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you for staying to the end. Okay. Okay. Then well, my friend. Good, good night. Take okay. care. See you tomorrow. Good okay. night. Good night, teacher. Good night. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Be good. Some people normally worry about when to use where and when to use did. The secret here is, what do you have 
It's a complement. Do you have a place? Do you have an adjective? Do you have a noun? Or do you have a verb? If you have a verb, the auxiliary to use is did. But if you have a noun, or do you have a place, or do you have an adjective, you have a, let's say, was or where. Okay, so you have say you because of say like you. Okay, and the, the, this is at home. Busy. So, were you at home? Were you busy? Were you a salesman? Obviously, over here, you have to use where? Why where? Easy. You're using a place. Right? Place. Or an adjective. If you're using an adjective, you have to use where. Or if you're using a noun, Jobs are nouns, right? So, this is kind of funny. Okay, so using a noun, a place, or an adjective you use where or was. Was she busy? Was he a salesman? Were you at home? Okay. Yet, yet, if you have a verb, If you use, if you see that you have a verb, like watch, you have to use did. Did you watch TV last night? Did you watch TV last night? Okay, check over here. What would you use in these places?
eight. Notice in the in these ones you have to say read. So let's underline the verbs. Let's underline the verbs. We have first read, then um, take. Who oh, am missing here? Something. Wait. Uh -huh. Over here. Coming again. We have the verb take. Cook. Wash. Do. Okay. These are the verbs. Read, take, cook, wash, and do. And what do we do when we have verbs? We use, we complete with did. So what am I going to do? No, I'm going to drag it. I'm going to drag it because I'm going to be lazy. Drag it. Okay. I'm going to drag it. All right, now for the others, we're going to use was or where, right? Let's see. I'm going to copy. Was your secretary in the office yesterday? Was she surprised to see you? Okay, but where? Were you angry yesterday? Were your grandparents immigrants? And uh, were you sick last week? So, this is how we know when to use was or were or did, okay? So, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for attending tonight. I'll see you tomorrow.